All right, we're just doing a video. I want to show you a, a sound or a, I guess let you hear a sound that I've got in my drive line. I haven't been able to figure out. It's been going on for uh, a few months and uh, probably 10,000 kilometers. So uh, once we get a chance to get on the highway here, I'll uh, start to go forward and uh, show you what I've got going on. This is a 2008.5 uh, Jeep Grand Cherokee with a diesel. Hear a whining. It's not related to the steering. Definitely related to speed. This came about when I did the uh, front differential bushings, so I suspect it's a differential or a CV, but it's not something I've been able to figure out. I've dumped the oil out of the uh, differential, didn't find anything. I'm going to go back in again today and change the cover on the differential as it leaks. So it's down stays when you come off the throttle. Got my winter tires on so they contribute to a little bit of sound. I guess I've got 130, there's enough vehicle speed you can't hear it very well. But it stays around. This part of this drive is just to warm up the uh, differential and make it easier to get the oil out of it. I guess I'll shut this down and then uh, we get to work on it. And hopefully, uh, if someone's familiar with the sound, they can uh, tell me what it is. All right, so we're back from the uh, test drive. I got the vehicles on ramps and I got some uh, wheel chocks on it. We're in neutral right now. I went over all of the U-joints uh, and CVs. So the, the rear axle, the U-joints are cool. I found that the CV going into the, uh, the front of the transfer case is uh, the warmest. And then the uh, CV on this uh, here, I don't know if the video just flipped over or not. But it was uh, it's a touch warm, but it's closer to the uh, transfer case than the uh, driver's side. But it, it's cool. So it seems that we've got uh, two CVs that might be a problem. I'll admit that I'm not very good at testing them. I'm in neutral. And uh, I don't feel anything unusual, to be honest. But I've had these break right in half on me. I never was able to determine they were bad up until that point. <laughs> so I'm not exactly an expert on that. Like I said, I think the video is going to flip back over around. So there's this one up here. Actually, you can see the outside is turning without the uh, inside turning. Not so easy to test that way. So I have to put the uh, camera down there to test it with both hands. So I guess I'll do that. But uh, so I'm thinking it might be the uh, front drive shaft that's the problem, but uh, I'm sure at this point. 